<laughs> How you doing? <laughs> Good. And so I'm back to get a get the air fixed, hopefully. Sains Barbershop in Morganton, North Carolina. So here's the before. How you been getting along, brother? Good, how are you? Pretty good. Pretty good. Man, do you okay over there? It's been a while since I've seen, talked to you. I, <laughs> I see you on Facebook and stuff now and again. <laughs> I can't help that. <laughs> it's not it's not on purpose. <laughs> Kelvin, you know what to do. Let's do that, ma that, that magic we, that you've yeah, been what doing. We, what we used to do. Yes. Yes, you're the man. You got the plan, and it always works. And it works for a long time, too. Yeah, that's what it's we're going to do. It's Take a, off just enough to... It's like I, it's, I get a good six weeks out of every, every haircut you do for them. <laughs> That's what people don't understand. I got one guy said he went to one of them fly by night places. He says, he says, well, I get it. Two he weeks says, I later, get, I got another haircut. I, got, I get a six dollar haircut, but his six dollar haircut, he, he's got to go twice, and it ends up being a twelve dollar haircut. When he could have got it for me, he could have got it for me, and it'd have been, it would have lasted That's in right. the time. That's right. But there's not everybody's. There's a lot of people out there not shaving. <laughs> they're not shaving. Uh, they're not shaving around the ears. Yeah. So you know they're going to be back quicker. Yep. He says, "Well, it'd be eight dollars, but I get one of them coupons in the mail." <laughs> and then he tells me, he said, he said, "Well, he says I wanted her to keep more hair on my head." He said, and uh, he said she took too much off on one side, so she had to go back on the other side and take just as much off. Wow. And, I, and I thought he, I just thought he got a hunt. I thought somebody just done his hair at the house. Wow. <laughs> I didn't think that he went and got it somewhere. Well, tell me something. You, like the haircut you did for me here, is this something you just come up with? Or just a certain style? Does it have a name? or? Not really. It's just, it just, it works. It fits. Yep. So, so you, you just kind of look haircut, at my head. If you, if you get it, and it. You just kind of look at my head and you say, I think I'd try and, that. And I've seen your website, <laughs> thing, whatever. I've seen you've had quite a bit of different. Oh, Lord, yeah. Yeah. You know, so. From here, you know. Yeah. Typically, what I start doing is when it starts to get a little shaggy and out of control, that's when I start putting hair gel in. Well, that's kind of, that's kind of plastic in my head. This is what I'm using on the top. You can still put something mm -hmm. in there. If it's a strong hold, you can still put something in there to make it do yeah. something. Yeah. But you with, know, I, I, don't, I don't usually do that. But when you, until, you, it gets that, got, until it gets yeah, out of it. It's probably three weeks before I can do anything with the haircut you give me. You know, I start getting some stuff in it. Yeah, you were the first one to give me a haircut here. So that's been oh, a long oh, yeah. time ago. Seven or eight years ago. You had that other guy. That one kept getting in the, the picture. Yeah. The video. John, like, John. 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 Is, still, is he still coming around to Hey, Yeah. He, he's down in Hickory now. Oh, right? is he? Yeah. He, he's still coming around from time to time. You just don't ever know what John's going to be. You don't know what John's going to be into. That is the truth. That's crazy. Then you want to look at it? You been anywhere interesting lately? I don't go anywhere. I just work. I, was, I you know, I, I, I showed somebody. I think you, you got your hair, hair cut last time, and I, I just pulled up on your Facebook thing just because I, I pulled it up before. Yeah. And I was like, you know, when people put on what they are, where are they from, what they've done, I said, have you ever seen anybody this long? Really? <laughs> I said, you're working on somebody that's, man, he's done a lot. I've been around for them, I mean, but you know. I, mean, I drove a school bus for, what, six years. I did some custodian work for four years. And, you know, I had not really done a whole lot. You know, I've been here for 20, 21 years. Yeah. So there's no, not a whole lot of. Well, my MO is being go wherever the pain to me. <laughs> yes. And I, so I moved around some, but the funny thing is I ended up going back to the same places, you know, like. I worked here in the hospital system, so I've been doing there. It's great. Then I've been Charlotte, then Ashley, 
Then they won't be back here, you know, so it's kind of whatever person. We are all afraid the most money all day. <laughs> I don't know if I remember telling you this, but one of the reasons Mandy came up, up here was one of our very of your videos, mate. She Did you see that. that video in Germany? Yeah, she told Mandy. me. Mandy, she, she saw it. Yeah, I was in Germany. Yeah, it was my favorite one. I, that that was one of the coolest things ever when you told me that. Yeah. That just that just that really was very. I was very happy to hear that. Yeah. Yeah. Some of Red's customers. He called them outside, whatever. And they. Oh, they come get my hair here since I was. What? Yeah. <laughs> I remember that now. Yeah. You standing out front there. Well, I had been, on the last haircut video I did was about two years ago with Tommy, so I hadn't done one a long time. I thought this one was all there. I got a new is camera. The, is the, is the, uh, the vocal, uh, the sound on it and everything, because I remember you used to yeah, have set, to put a... The sound, the sound's always bad. It's, it's, it's hard in a place like this. Yeah, picking up clippers. They ain't going to hear as much. Probably, I'll probably do is probably speed up and show you kind of in fast time how you, oh, cool. how you fit it. So that may just have a music track or something on where I'll just talk a little bit. Say, hey, this is killed and it's a goddamn hey, bearded it's barber. <laughs> bearded barber. Now you've let that thing grow out, haven't you? Oh yeah, I got, I got a, I got a beard. That's what I'll, I'll show. I'll show before and after the first time I met you to now. <laughs> yeah. I've got a, I got that heater. Heater. Thing that, this thing here goes up to 400 degrees. Uh, Go hit that. Pop that up to 400. And then you can like straight that thing. Yeah, basically all I do is just, just run through it and it'll, 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 it'll smooth it out. <laughs> It takes a little bit, but it don't take it long Check to it see out. it popping up. Aquage A Q U A G E. Bayless, Bayless Pro. Bayless Pro. Well, we'll, that, we'll give them a shout out in the video. <laughs> yeah, I mean, as far as a, it's got a ceramic plate. It does go up to 400, but it's got a, it's got a ceramic plate to it to the point where it don't yeah. burn you. I've got one with a metal plate on it at the house. Yeah. And, uh, you, you'll smoke, you'll smoke some hair. You don't work, <laughs> or you'll wash it. I only put it on 248 is the only thing I'll run it because it's, I mean, it'll, it'll toast it. Last year, I think it was last year, maybe the year before last, I built a deck. I took a week off work to build a deck for my mother in while I didn't shave for a week. First time I hadn't shaved in probably about eight or nine days. And my, mine came, my beard came out total white. I put a picture of it on Facebook. I, I compared it to my red, everybody told me, well, you look 10 years old. <laughs> yeah. Well, you know, they had that app. They had that app on. Oh, check that out. That Holy God. Hey, uh, real diet. More beard, less belly. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> but they did that uh, old app. Look how white that. Look how white that. They let him in. He's he, 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 he good out. <laughs> yeah, first time I saw David, actually. He started doing a talk show or something. I can't believe he uh, had that big Santa Claus beard. He looked good though. It's, it's, oh, yeah. it's good on I wonder if he started doing it just because people recognized him so much he did. You know? Yeah, I mean, I could so go somewhere and put a hat on Yeah. I could be right beside, eating beside somebody that comes yeah. in here. And then I know who you are. And I'm okay. Yeah. Then some of them look like you looked up and under my cap or thing and go, hey, it's you, you know? <laughs> But it's taking them getting a full on look. Yeah. Because so they're just like, where's some bearded guy? Uh, <laughs> and here, they, they coincide with my head. Like, if, I, if I don't have any that have my small head, then I don't have it. Then they're like, <laughs> How many days a week do you work here now, Kelvin? You still five, five? five days. I'm off on Monday. Monday, work Tuesday through Saturday. So you got Sandy and Mandy all so Yep. I'm going to back in here to Tuesday morning. That gives me a little time to yep. relax a little bit. Yep. It used to be Wednesday. I didn't have enough time to really relax. Yeah. But it need, need to be two days in a row. Yeah. 
I'm not going to do a whole lot on a Sunday, but at least I can think about what I'm going to do on Monday. Yeah. And then sometimes everything gets backed up with my wife working seven days a week. Yeah, where's she work? Continental. Oh. She's working seven days a week. Plus, she just started another semester in school, taking on three classes. What, what's she studying in school? Business side of office administration. Oh, okay. She's got her associates now. She's trying to get her bachelor's, but I, I don't know. She's a little behind. Something's going to have to give. Yeah. Is it an office job she's got? My, my daughter. She's working on the like MKC friends. One line. The new million dollar expansion that they're doing. Wow. Yeah. You know, you know, I, I get to do those work and work videos. Yeah. Right yeah. Now. I went to Continental Man. I was amazed at what all they got in there. Well, I mean, a lot of times they can get rid of employees. Why? Because they can get a machine. Yeah. They got at some point in time, they can get a machine to do the exact same, same thing. That they can engineer it to do it. Yeah. yeah. That's what the journey is yeah. all about. And I have to say, you know, the whole time I was there shooting that video, I don't think I saw 20 or 30 people in that whole huge plant. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, well, that's what one guy said. If yeah. you go to some of these automotive places, they got a big old plant up there. Yeah. And you'd be up there at night, and there'd be one guy in some little room, like a control room, and then there won't be a whole engine, but it'll be running wide open. They're making brakes for tears, words, and all kinds of stuff. There. Yeah. 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 I found that very neat some clothes. That has been probably one of the coolest things I've got to do in the last, say, three years. Is that that work and book program, I got the kind of the contact to do, you know, most of the employee profiles. They use another group to do similar promotional stuff, but I, I do most of it. And you can just get to go into all the points and see what they do. You know, see the oh, operations. Yeah, yeah. You know, you drive by the places that it's just like a big old building, you know, and they can keep going with the battle, then get to go in and see what's doing. going on. It's pretty oh, yeah. amazing. The technology and robotics and computer, the computer programmable stuff that they have. Works on a pretty high tech. How many Japanese and German companies that we have? Yeah. The Carbon, there's carbon a, plant is a German, German owned. But I did this one that was called Equinus. Equinus, they make a, a real high end kind of chair and sofa. Yeah. And they're like Scandinavian, something. They're like Norwegian or oh, yeah. Swedish or something like that. You know, they're one of those Scandinavian countries. Yeah. And then it did several German ones. And, it's some American ones, you know. Well, that last boy I did, I've been doing his hair since he was a little, little bitty kid. And his uh, grandmother used to bring him in. Yeah. And then something happened with her and the guy that she was dating or whatever and it was like he didn't come in for a long time after that just because that guy still came in here and so oh, okay. it was like what well, he was able to cut his hair all them years you know but he ended up coming back that's cool <laughs> Is this not been like the weirdest, weirdest winter yeah. ever? Yeah, yeah, but actually it's almost like our, our area is blessed though. If you think about the rest of the country know, and what man. they've been going through. I know. And I had a guy from the other day come from uh, they just having snow and winter and all this stuff and he yeah. comes here and it's like we're just, we ain't had enough. I've never I've never been through a winter where we had no ice. Minnesota. So far. Minnesota, Minnesota, Minnesota is where he was from. We've had no ice, we've had no we've, it's, we've had no snow. They've had 
planes that couldn't get off the ground and all has it has it even frosted five times at your house no i think i think i've had maybe three days of frost that i've had to like do something to my windshield or something like that well, that one day did 70 degrees it was a monday yeah. i think it hit about 70 yeah. degrees on a monday I'm like, you know, I'm about to burn up. Yeah. A lot of times he, he opens the door. Or he's opening the door. It's like, that's weird. I like you think about how how much more we're still going than other places. You know, not able to move and do. Yeah. My dad's like one of the best. He had that wind storm a couple weeks ago. That's so. I was up on Mill Springs Mountain. Man, it hit like a dang. Well, it blows up air. It, it, <laughs> it blows up air all the time anyway. I think it hit 70 mile an hour. It blew a tree over. Power went out for about three or four hours. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Be in the city garage, it's just right up the hill. Mm. And you're asking about the sound on that camera. It's got a microphone in front, which they usually they get, didn't have in the past. So yeah, this is kind of a test to see how it works. I'm, I'm curious if it picks anything up. That's a kind of a new one. What do you do with your old stuff? You just keep it? Yeah, I've kept them mostly. Or like my brother might want to use them for a game, game cam or something. You know, I've let, him, I've let various people have different ones. And, and, uh, Man, you What's that? Yeah. I dropped, yeah. I think I dropped mine in the parking lot. I heard something fall out of my, my car. Yeah. And I couldn't find it. I couldn't find it. And um, I never found my GoPro again. Like, Are I'm you like, kidding? I bet it oh, probably rolled into the car. You know what I mean? It probably bounced to the back. Yeah. Oh my God. Can you that? These new ones, Mandy, if you're doing your hiking videos, uh -huh. like at Hero 8 there, now it, it, it's. It's the prices have come down on them actually. They're still fairly expensive, but not much. You know, 399 bucks or something. But that one right there looks like it's on a steady cam. You can put that on a stick and go walking. I mean, it looks like somebody's just gliding in front of them. They've big time changed the uh, stabilization. On them. It looks really good. I never thought her to be very stable anyway, but well, it'll make her stable. <laughs> it'll make her look like. <laughs> She might be like jumping over rocks and stuff. It'd look like there's a little drone flying around her. Oh. <laughs> so which one is that? This one? It's the Hero 8. The Hero 8? Hero 8. Yeah, it's, it's the latest one. It's good. Real good. You should, you should treat yourself. <laughs> then lock it down. Yep. <laughs> don't lose. Yeah, don't lose in the parking lot. <laughs> Oh, man. I'm definitely I'm like, I never took that thing. And I must have been talking about it. I'll be telling people about it when I was younger. Yeah. 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 Yeah
uh, back and forth and finished in two years. And, uh, and my ex-wife was with me before we got divorced. Anyway, when she got on a trip to Las Vegas with me. And so, and, uh, you know, we, I never, I never been one I like to see see all the gentlemen. I don't really gamble. Right, right, right. Yeah, that's me. If we go up the Harris, it's seeing all these people wasting all that time, whatever, smoking cigarettes, and the weirdest looking people. Yeah, I know. We can go up there and just look. Yeah. It's like the weirdest looking people. Yeah. 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 Ye
Hey, have you written any more books lately? Yeah. You're working on anything? I've got two more out, but they're, um, the author was um, controversial, and they pulled it um, to check to make sure it wasn't. So they got clear that we're just waiting for them to. You gonna put them on Amazon again? Yeah. Well, it'll go on. That's crazy. That looks great. That's much better. How do you get some? They weren't mine. They were, they were basically just, just, just covers my head, not to me. That's great. They weren't my books. They were, um, but I narrated them. Oh, so, uh, that's cool. My author is You've got a cool voice for something like that. <laughs> you do that. <laughs> me? No. <laughs> yeah. Oh, he was, man, he sounded great, didn't he? And he, he, he when he says the words that supposed to be said the right way and all yeah. that stuff, he's like, but he had a very regal voice. Yeah. It sounded like God talking. <laughs> And then you'll get one of them other translations and some other guys on it. You're like, eh. Yeah, that's not quite so much better. Alexander's Corby sounds a little better. I have a book I'm finishing up, but I got, I literally have like one more chapter to read. Huh? Maybe two. Uh, fiction? Yeah. I, I am like in awe of you that you do that. I tried to write a book. I've got like 60 chapters of it written. Wow, 60 chapters. That's a lot. It's, it's a. Uh, oh gosh. You know what? I would have sent you a couple chapters on it just to see what you think. Just just to see. It's a. Uh, my boss, it was sort of like a, we did a New Year's resolution one year. And. What, 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 rather than, you know, when we're going to lose weight or something, we decided we're going to do something artistic. And I decided I'd try to write a book. And, and uh, my boss challenged me. He said, well, yeah, you got to write something you know. And I don't know a whole lot of stuff. He said, and he said, but, you know, horror is supposedly the easiest genre to write. what they say. And he said, anyway, I, because everybody, all of us have fears, you know. And so take something you know and make a horror story out of it. So... I, I won't burden you with it, but I'll send you a few, uh, maybe you'll send you a link to it. <laughs> see what you think. I already started the outline on my next one. Yeah, yeah. Oh, gosh, I love Dexter. The thing you like about Dexter is, you know, everybody would like to righteously kill some bow. <laughs> <laughs> See, like some right, if you, as long as you're in the right, you know. <laughs> That's what was the, the, the charm of that show. Is he's a serial killer that only kills bad people. <laughs> She's gonna. Um, yeah, she'll be a. Uh, <laughs> Black Widow. I'm buying a program that's a bit ready in Oh, oh, in other words, to write it like a screenplay, like a television? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, that's exactly. cool. Yeah. 
so that each episode could be like a different. So that what? Each episode could be a different. Oh, that's cool. You might end up selling one of those then, you know? Yeah, maybe that can... That's what they're always looking for is ideas. You know, that's the hardest thing I think in television. There's not there. really any real true real true ideals anymore. It's almost like they're taking yeah, something. Everything's a copy of something all, else. Or, yeah. They're yeah, taking a copy of something else. That's the first thing they teach you too in that creative writing. No original something. No Tommy, take it easy, brother. Yes, sir. Good, Good to see you. you as always. Do <laughs> what? Singing to Jared. Watch this. Watch the little girl at the end. Watch the end, better. Pretty cute. <laughs> Take it easy, brother. Oh, mercy. So there's the result. That's the finish. Pretty cool. By Kelvin.